Hello again, it's John Peel on the BBC World Service. Did I tell you that I sometimes hear these programmes myself in the middle of the night in London? So, in case I'm listening to this one, hello John, here's a record I know you like. Perky item on the Fortuna pop record label, that's from the Eyeless set, it's a single called The Red Door, and Greensleeves Records recently celebrated their 25th birthday, and uh, they had a two-hour programme on domestic radio to play some of their greatest hits of yesteryear, and accountably they missed this one out, which is one of my all-time favourites, from the Wailing Souls, this is Mass Charlie Grant, I particularly like, I mean the lyrics are by and large completely unintelligible to me, but there's a place where they go, work down wookie do that's what it sounds like, that was the bit that always sold it for me, I have to say.
So, walk down, walkie do it is. Those are the Wailing Souls from the 1983 LP on Greensleeves Records called Inch Pinches, and that was Mass Charlie Ground. A great track, no question about it. And this is Cinerama, not in English for once. This is a version of their song Superman in Spanish. <laughs>
I get the feeling from that that Superman in Spanish is Superman, and why not? That's Cinerama. And I'm always uneasy about the notion that pop music has to be sung in English, so good to them for doing that. That's uh, a seven-inch single on their own Scopy Tones record label. And from New Orleans, this is Spickle. <laughs> Storming stuff from New Orleans, that's Spittle. Track does end very quickly, doesn't it? Millennium Falcon is the title of the tune, and it's on Berserker Records from uh, somewhere in Colorado, a place called Highlands Ranch, which sounds lovely. And uh, this next is from a compilation called Afrique Dynamique, and uh, it's on Nascente Records. It's by Shalamwana, and I have to say that I think she starts singing off slightly off-key, but uh, she quickly resolves this, and when Dalekimoko's guitar playing starts, well, it more than makes up for it, I think. This is called Banda Yanda. <laughs> Yeah. 
Kimoko on blistering form on Shalomwana's Banda Yango, and that's on a compilation LP called Afrique Dynamique from 1996. And my son William's girlfriend Zara's father Salim occasionally sends me records from Japan, and uh, he sent me one, a new one from the ruins called Palashtom. And uh, there are a number of tracks on there, they, they use their own language, 16 tracks in their own language, one of which I will play you at some stage. But the last three tracks are all little medleys. There's a classical music medley and a hard rock medley and a progressive rock medley. And it's the hard rock medley I'm going to play you now. And in something, in just over two and a half minutes, they play extracts from 27 different tunes. See how many you can spot. Very clever, very difficult to play, I would have thought. 27 tunes worked into that, the hard rock medley from the ruins, from their new LP, Palash Tom. And there are so many dance records around at the moment, I mean, far too many to really represent adequately on the radio in any programme, I think. But a lot of people forget that much of uh, what we hear nowadays had its origins in the Brussels of the 1980s with tracks like this. <laughs> Thank you. 
we forget what a great track that was from 1988 sm by sm and it comes from an lp new beat take one hard to find these days i would imagine over to foothills nightclub long beach california <laughs> I have to admit, I don't know if there is such a place as Foothills Nightclub in Long Beach or whether it's some kind of Californian joke that I don't understand. But this is from an LP by Los Stray Jackets. It's the last track I have for you this week here on the BBC World Service. It comes from an LP called Damas y Caballeros and it's called Tailspin. Thanks very much for listening. Until next week, from me, John Peel. Goodbye.